Let's look at finding the equation of a circle whose diameter has endpoints negative 10, negative 8, and 8, negative 4. We want to write it in the form x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is equal to r squared, and then be able to find the center and radius. So to start, let's look at finding the center. What we can look at then, because we have the endpoints of the diameter, is finding the midpoint between those two points. And to find the x-coordinate of our midpoint, we simply look at finding the average of our x values. So we have negative 10 plus 8 over 2. Do this negative 2 over 2, which is negative 1. To find the y-coordinate, we'll take the average of our y values, so negative 8 plus negative 4 over 2. We have negative 12 over 2, which is negative 6. And so the center of our circle is negative 1, negative 6. And we know in our form, x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared, that h represents the x-coordinate of our center, and k represents the y-coordinate of our center. And so we know that h equals negative 1, and k equals negative 6. We can substitute these into the formula. And so we have x minus negative 1 squared, or x plus 1 squared and y minus negative 6 squared, or y plus 6 squared, equals r squared. Notice that we're still missing the last constant, r, and we can find that by substituting in one of our points in for x and y. We could use either point. I'm going to use the point negative 10, negative 8, and so we have negative 10 plus 1 squared plus negative 8 plus 6 squared equals r squared. And now we simplify it. So negative 10 plus 1 squared gives us negative 9 squared. And negative 8 plus 6 squared gives us negative 2 squared. Negative 9 squared is 81. Negative 2 squared is 4. And so we have r squared equals 85. We know then that our radius is the square root of 85. And our circle is x plus 1 squared plus y plus 6 squared equals 85.